Hey, I want to share something with you that was in the church bulletin today at the church I attend. It says here, During the 16th century, valiant Christians were turning against the Romanist church. A man by the name of the clerk took his stand for Christ and salvation through simple faith. In July of 1525, he was led to the stake to be burned. There he was made to sh sit on sharp nails and afterward was bound with iron chains. Some of the people cried to him to renounce his faith, but he refused, saying, quote, I cling to the Lord Jesus Christ who died for me. End quote. When the executioner, with his red-hot tongs, wanted to pull off his nose, the clerk, looking in the other direction, involuntarily turned his head away from the heat of the iron. By this movement, his lips were burned off to the teeth. Then when he understood what they wanted to do, he, bro he bore the cruel mutilation without uttering a cry of pain. The executioner then drew three circles around his head with the burning iron as a punishment for having damaged the crown of the image of Mary. His right hand was torn off and the fire was lit. In the, mid the midst of the smoke and flames, his face shone like that of an angel as the wood was crackling about him and as flames licked over his body, the dying man cried out, quote, Their idols are silver and gold, the works of men's hands. They that make them are like unto them, and so is everyone that trusteth in them. O Israel, trust thou in the Lord, who is thy help and shield. End quote. God gives us Christians who stand when all is contrary. And uh, I just wanted to share that with you. Um, you know, sometimes we forget how persecuted Christians in, in other time periods actually were. And um, I have a massive book called Martyr's Mirror that uh, just records for centuries, you know, stories like this of, of Christians who were tortured and, and burned at the stake uh, for their faith. And, um, you know, at least for now, in the Western world, at least for now, um, we Christians do have it, you know, pretty well off. We're not persecuted to the extent that, uh, whether the, the clerk was, and I have no idea who this man is, but I love to give him a hug in heaven and he has his peace now um, but anyways um, remember that Jesus is always with you cling on to the Lord Jesus who died for you and also just as a warning know that If the unsaved religious right were in charge of a nation, this is what they would do to people who actually believe the Bible. <laughs>